Hi, my name is Lou Wilkinson from far away Indiana, and here's another uh, short video on Linux music for beginners. Uh, we try to show you that any reasonably intelligent, marginally curious person has uh, access to pro quality, just killer tools uh, in a Linux environment. Uh, and a series of short videos to show you just how easy uh, it is to get started using them. Okay, this one's going to be real quick. It is uh, Audacity and AutoDuck. Uh, I don't know how handy it is, uh, maybe if you're a radio announcer, but it is just too too cool not to not to put a couple minutes in on it. So uh, here we go. Okay, as always, we'll look at the uh, versions. Uh, very frustrating to try to teach yourself something and find out that the version you're using isn't the version that you're uh, looking at the instruction for. So take a look here. If something in your system doesn't look like uh, what's shown in the video, then uh, this is the place to start. Okay, so here we go. As you can see, I have Audacity up, and I have a track, Wales on Europa, and I have a voice track, as it turns out, that second one. And let's uh, let's mute that and just uh, play. So there's some sound. We'll mute that and unmute this and play. Okay, this is Lou from far away Indiana talking to you. Uh, yeah. Okay, and so there's the voice track. Now, the one thing to keep in mind about AutoDuck with Audacity is that this is the track we're auto-ducking, the top one, and this is called, uh, when you use auto-duck, the control track. And the control track always has to be directly under the, uh, the track we're trying to duck. So let's mute nothing, and you'll see what a mess this is when uh, you try to keep both these together. As you can see, you can barely hear me. So let's uh, go select that track. And we'll just go to Effect, Auto Duck. And this says a half a second before the control track. Drop it 14 decibels and a half a second after the control track. Raise it 14 decibels. So let's uh, run that plug in. And notice what it did. Now you might not like this in the middle, but I'll talk about that in a, in a second. So let's go. Let's go look at this. Now tell me, that's pretty darn cool. Now, let's say uh, we don't like this in the middle. We want it to stay low. Let me uh, undo the auto duck and come in and do it again. And this time I'll say instead of a half a second in front, uh, let's give it a whole second in front and a whole second behind. Uh, and you'll see that it kept it down. So let's... Uh, Let's try playing it again. Uh, okay, this is Lou from far away Indiana talking to you in this Audacity Auto Duck experiment. And it is, as you'll see, very, very simple.
Now tell me that's not cool. Okay, so that's all there is to it. Uh, the only thing you have to do is make sure that your control track or voice track is under the track you're trying to duck. Uh, after that, it just uh, it's a slam dunk. Thanks. Okay, that's it for this week. Stick with me as we explore all the really uh, great tools that are out there for music in a Linux environment. The people at Google, YouTube, whoever keep uh, telling me I should encourage you to subscribe to this channel so you might consider that. Otherwise, see you next time. Thank you.